Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, as you could tell by the name of the name <laughs> and the name, as you could tell from the name of the video, this is gonna be a get ready with me slash Q and A. What am I doing today? Oh, today I'm going to my nephew's first birthday party. I'm excited. I'm so happy he's gonna be one. I just. I didn't just wake up. I woke up like at 7, I think. It's currently 9.27. I need to paint my toenails. Because my toenails not looking cute. Well, I mean, okay. Rocco painted my toenails. But, see, they're cute and everything. It's just, they're orange. And orange is not going to match what I'm going to wear. I'll show you guys what I'm going to wear later. It's a surprise. I just need a different color. Like, it's not, it's not working. Anyways, let's start with the first question. Five facts about me. That's kind of hard. Like you know how you have to do that all the time in um. Like when you first get when you have your first day of school or something, or you know, stuff like that, like little icebreakers or something. That's always really hard. Oh, one fact about me is I hate cricket so much. Like so much, so much. If I were to be around crickets and shenanigans, like, I walk outside and I see a cricket and I'm like, eh! all scared, like, you know? I don't know, I just do not like crickets. I think it's because, okay, one time, when I was, like, 12, my mom locked me in the restroom. <laughs> she locked me in the restroom with the cricket because she knew I didn't like crickets. She was like, I'm not going to do nothing to you. And, oh, that was so scary. It was so scary. And then I was at the park. Another time, I was like, maybe like 15, 14. I was just in a bad mood. We were at the park in the nighttime. And my little brother goes and gets a cricket. And I was like, ew, get away from me with that. And he decides to put it in my shirt. I was, I freaked out and I started crying. Like, I, ugh. I was saying I was extra, but no, like, I just, I, I don't like crickets. Like, they scare me. Like, what if they just, like, bite me and, like, Suck out on my blood, like, mm -mm. nope, nope. I even drew. I even like, no, I wasn't drew. I didn't draw it. I painted. I had an art class during the summer, and I painted a cricket, and it looked so demonish. I gave it to Rocco though. I'm gonna ask him for a picture of it, and I'm gonna put it right here. Here's my scary cricket. Fact number two. I have ten siblings in total. I can't think of a fact number three. See, there's not that much about me. Okay, I like fashion. That's another fact about me. I think a, a lot of my, my my fashion inspiration comes from my prima. Her name's Adalia. Um, I don't know. I just always thought she was cool and stuff. And the way she dressed, like, it was really cool to me. You know, I've always been girly. Like, ever since I was little, I was just always girly. Let's think of fact number four. Fact number four, I like dark chocolate better than I like milk chocolate or, you know, regular chocolate. And I just really like dark chocolate. It's, it's good to me. I don't know. A lot of people don't like dark chocolate. Don't come for me. Ew! What? You just start painting them because it does not have to be perfect. Should I just come back to fact number five to the end? Yeah, I'm going to do that. Next question. If you could move to another state, which state would it be and why? Hmm. Another state. I, I honestly like California. Like, I like, well, yeah, I kind of, I like it here, you know? It's pretty cool. I mean, this is all I know, if I think about it. This is all I know, so I kind of like it here. But if I had to move to another state, um, let me think. I don't know. I feel like Oregon is pretty. Maybe Oregon. I, I just feel like it's pretty, you know what I mean? Like, it, the trees and all that stuff. <laughs> I don't know. I honestly don't know. Maybe Oregon. Sounds pretty. Sounds natureful. Sounds quiet. Because I don't, I don't really hear about nobody from Oregon that much. Yeah, maybe Oregon. How you been? E. Let's see. How have I been? I think I've been alright. You know, obviously I've been better. Everyone has, you know, everyone has been better. So, oh no oh no it does not look like there's any nail polish it's like clear i forgot that this was like clear it was just like a shimmer i have ugly nails i have ugly toes like 
type of ugly nails. Oh well, doing this color. <laughs> Anyways, um, how have I been? I've been alright. I've been better. Um, I tend to get over a lot of things, like you know, like like I'd be sad and stuff, but I end up getting over it within like max two days. Within two days, I'll be over it. But like. I mean, obviously, you know, shit's hard, but that's for everybody. It's like that for everybody. That's how life is. You know, it's not like you're just gonna have it easy all the time. Yeah, like, I, I tell myself, like, what do you expect, you know? I, like, I just have to keep trying, bro. Like, that's all it is. Like, it's hard to wake up sometimes in the morning, but I have to, and, you know? That's just really what it is. Yeah. Overall, I've been good. Like, honestly, I've been... I've been doing really good actually. I haven't really been hit with depression that hard lately. I mean, not really. I'm grateful for that. Even though sometimes I feel like, oh my god, like I hate my life and this and this and that. At the end of the day, like, I could have it so much worse. And I'm so grateful, you know, that I'm doing good. That I'm in a place where, you know, I'm safe. I don't know how to explain it. My toes look ugly. Oh well. Let's see next question. See, I'm like painting my toenails this whole time. Okay, I'm gonna finish painting my nails and I'll answer the rest of the question. So you know how I was like, okay, I'm gonna go paint my toenails and then I'll be back. So I painted them, but one, they look really ugly. Like they look clumpy. Two, I broke my nail polish. <laughs> Like, I was shaking it. You know how, like, when you get a nail polish, right? And you go like that, like, to shake it? Well, I did that, and that shit broke. Like, broke, broke. And it splattered everywhere. Look at my hand. It is all filled with freaking nail polish. My bed. I'm sad. I need to clean it off. <laughs> yeah, don't come off. Anyways, now I'm going to pluck out my eyebrows because my eyebrows are not looking good right now. Ow! That one hurt. Next question. What made me want to start a YouTube? Um, I don't know. See, I think everyone ever, like, at least once in their life is like, oh my god, imagine being a YouTuber. Well, me, you know. I was like, oh, that would be so fun. I just figured, like, it would be fun. Like, I talk to myself a lot anyways, you know? So, might as well talk to a camera and make a video and actually have something to talk about you know what i mean i feel like it just distracts me and you know it's fun and blah 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 it is fun i like doing videos like they're just fun to do you know what i mean and like oh it's making my eye cry and then i thought like i like i like fashion i like making outfits and stuff so why not just like do something with it you know what i mean oh my god this hair does not want to come off oh got it <laughs> see i don't do my eyebrows like i rarely do them like probably get them done like once every six months and whenever i do them i'm so unsatisfied this unsatisfied dissatisfied maybe dissatisfied i'm not sure but i just ugh. whenever i get them done i feel like the ladies make them too thin so i rather just do them myself like they don't come out a profession or anything but you know it's better than having them all thin. Ow, I pinched myself again. Oh. Oh, I'm going to make sure this video is not like a thousand minutes long. Because that always happens to me. I'm going to edit out more. So I finished plucking out my eyebrows. Ugh. I had a lot of hairs right here. But, you know, I plucked them out. And, you know, that's really all I do. Now, what am I going to do now? I need to clean myself up. I really have all this shit on me. I'm gonna Google how to take nail polish off of skin because it's not cute. So I tried taking the nail polish off. For the most part, it came off. But there's some parts that didn't want to come off. I See, I looked on Google and it told me to use white vinegar. I used it. It smelled ugly. But it didn't come off with that. So that was a lie. Um, but I did go to the kitchen and I got some dish soap, some, 
I got some dish soap. What is what dish soap do we use? I think we use Dawn. Well, I got some dish soap, and it came off better with that than did it, than it did with um the vinegar. So now I know. What am I gonna do next? I don't want to put my outfit on yet because that's barely ten. Maybe my hair, huh? I could do my hair. My lips are so dry. <clears throat> I like Twix. Here. What will I do to my hair today? I'm going to split my hair in half. And then I'm going to do a half ponytail right here. Like that. Yep, that's what I'm doing. The next question. Well, there's one that asks first pet name. My first pet's name. Um, I don't, honestly, I don't know. I remember we had a pet. It was my well, it was my dad's dog. His name was Bingo. I don't know if that counts, cause there was Bingo. I remember I had a Chihuahua named Dulce. My grandparents had a dog named Cafe. Um, I I grew up with my grandparents and my mom, but you know, it was like my family. You know what I mean? Like we lived together as a family. Oh, we had a dog named Precious. I know I asked for the first one, but you know, I feel like mentioning all my pets because why not? We had kittens. My cat was named Ma. It was like the mom cat. Named her Ma. She had like a bunch of kitties. I remember we were taking care of... <laughs> we were taking care of one of my aunt's friend's dogs. And unfortunately that dog got stolen at our house his name was gonzo honestly i really liked gonzo like it was he was a big dog i don't know what type of dog he was and somebody came in our house and stole him i remember i had some bunnies if i'm being honest i do not remember their names my most recent last pet that i've had was a cat that my friend edith from middle school gave me she gave me her when she was a kitty she was really small and when she gave me her she was small and she had her eye like shut closed one of my cousins, he helped, I guess, take that off. If you know what I mean. Like, the eye got better. Um, her name was... I named her Belinda. After Belinda Car Carso. I, I, I used to like her music. Um, a short name was Bella, and I called her Bella. Oh my god! How am I gonna forget about Bo? I had a dog named Bo. And, um, you know, she lived in my room, and she would always shit on the floor in the middle of the night. <laughs> we also had another dog named Honey, but that one was a baby, and it ended up dying. We were so sad. I remember the day that she died. We took her to the vet, and she died at the vet. And we were just so sad that day. Everybody was so sad. And... That was little Honey. She was a little baby chihuahua. Rest in peace, Honey. What was I saying, though? Bonita. Okay, oh yeah, that's not, okay. Cats make me itchy. So I ended up, like, you know, she stopped going into my room. She used to live with me in my room, and I just couldn't have her in my room no more. And she would, she went with my sister. Like, my sister started taking care of her, and they renamed her Bonita. That still makes me mad. She's like, it's not Bella, it's Bonita. And no, it's Bella. Like, that's my cat, and I named her Bella. And that's just all it is, you know? She still, I still have her. Well, I don't still have her. She lives with my grandparents. You know, she's in my grandparents' house. But she's still alive. She's, yeah, she's still there. Honestly, like, to actually have a pet, for a pet, I would prefer a cat because they're easier to take care of. Like, in my opinion, they're way easier to take care of. Gum? Oh. You stole one of my gums? No, I borrowed it. No. Oh, my God. I hate it when you take my things without asking. I borrowed it. No, you didn't. You stole it. That's considered stealing. We're just stealing gum. What the heck? Okay, another question. Oh, Ada asked me, when are we going to hang out? See, it's hard to hang out with people because, like, no offense, no offense. But every time, like, I have the chance to hang out with someone, I'd rather hang out with Rocco. No offense, but, you know... Like, like, <laughs> he's just my go-to person, but I don't know, like, I'll see when I hang out with you, Ava. When you watch this, I hope you hear that. I'll see when I hang out with you. Like, I want to hang out with you too, don't get me wrong, like, I love you. I just wish you went to the same school as me. 
No. She doesn't love you. She says she does. She doesn't. Okay, guys. Okay. Ay, Wendy, como chingas? Um, how is the place that I'm at? The place that I'm at is alright. I mean, obviously, I have these days where I'm like, oh, I wish I could get out of here. I don't want to be here anymore. Like, you know, like, stuff like that. But, I mean, if I think about it, it's probably one of the best places I'll be at. Like, this home is actually really good. Like, I get fed every day, you know. I'm able to see Rocco, you know, he gets to come over and stuff. Um, I mean, I get tired of, don't get me wrong, I get tired of being here, like. But I mean, I think that just happens to everyone who's in the system. Like, literally everyone. Like, obviously you just want to go home and shit, but that won't happen. So you kind of just gotta, like, live with what you got. And this, what I got, like, right now, like, where I'm at, it's not that bad, honestly. Senora Consuelo is really sweet. Um, yeah. Why I gotta be bald for it? Like, what the heck? Who said I could be bald? Who gave me permission to be bald? Let me show you guys. Okay, I'm gonna put my outfit on already because I'm just trying to finish getting ready already. And then I'm gonna do my face and I. I'll finish the questions when I do my face. Okay. So I finished my hair. I have my outfit on already. I'm going to do my makeup. I'm not going to put a lot of makeup. I don't feel like wearing a lot of makeup. Because for what? I'm just like, you know, the usual. Curl my eyelashes. Um, brush my eyebrow hairs. And put a, maybe a little bit of mascara. I need to finish with the questions. So, let me see what question is next. Okay. So, favorite song. I'm guessing it will right for the moment. Like, honestly, my favorite song changes all the time. All the time. For the moment, it's So Gone, I think, by Monica. I don't know. I just really like that song. Like, it's cute. I like all types of music for what reason. I don't know. But, um... I like a lot. I like mostly R&B. Mostly. I listen to everything, you know. Like, um, If we're to say my favorite artist at the moment, it would probably be Erica Badu. Probably Erica Badu. Um, my cousin put me on. She used to listen to the song Tyrone. That song is not my favorite song, but like I looked into, I looked into her more, and I was like, oh, I really fuck with her music. Like, I really like her music. I don't know. And then I follow her on Instagram and everything. She's just so cute to me. Like, I love her spirit. I love... I love her. Like, she's freaking Ms. Badu. Like, come on. Now. Like, that's the queen right there. Okay, mascara is on. Next question. What has been my favorite outfit? Um, Honestly, I like most of my outfits that I make up. You know, like, most of my outfits, I just love them. Like, my favorite one, let me think. I don't think I have a favorite, but like, you know, like I have like these ones that I just really like. I like this outfit that I have like this little red shirt and it has like bows right here. Hopefully I find a picture and I put it in here. Probably don't have a picture. I don't really take a lot of pictures of my outfits. I always wear like my little, I have like these little earrings that are strawberries and I just wear that shirt and those pants. I also have like these dark blue jeans. They're like, what do they call like mom jeans? They're like that, and I like wearing that together. I think that's one of my favorites. Okay, next question. I'm gonna put lip gloss on. Next question: Do you ever miss your old self? Um, yeah, a lot actually. I'm not gonna lie, I do. Um, I used to be like really. I don't know, I just felt like I was really, before I used to be really um, just happy and positive and, you know, like, I just used to, I don't know, like, I had that spark in me, like, it was just cool, like, it was amazing. I just miss the positive energy I used to have, like, sometimes now I just get in a, in a cloudy mood, and... I mean, before I wasn't really judgmental. I remember not in ninth grade, I was just like, 
I wasn't judgmental. I was really nice. Um, I, you know, I had a lot to think about. I, I was like, you know, I was myself. I think I did. I didn't really take any influences. You know, I was just, you know, myself. Like all the way. You know, if that makes sense. You know. Um, I did my own thing. You know. I miss. Yeah, I miss myself. My my old self. I think it was pretty cool back then. But oh well. I'm me now. Ugh. Ugh. Ew. Jackie asked. First impression of me. Okay, Jackie. Jackie is my old roommate. I don't know if you guys remember. First impression of Jackie. Um, at first I seen her, I was like, oh, she, you know, she looks mellow. She looks, you know, like a little quiet girl. Um, you know basic first impressions like, yeah I, I didn't really think much of you i was like oh okay this is my new roommate i guess you seem kind of boring not gonna lie jackie seems boring because she you know she came here with all her stuff and I, I i was like asking her questions and she was like answering them really dry i was like all right <laughs> okay so i think that's it for this video oh i feel so tired now my room's a mess like i have like all this shenanigans right here i'm getting ready this is how I'm gonna look. Um, next time I post a Q&A, please ask questions. Like, give me something to talk about. So it's the next day. <laughs> I forgot to take a video of my outfit or a picture of my outfit. So, uh, sorry. I'm sad because my shirt that I was wearing yesterday got stained with paint. I'm like so sad about that. Because like, that was like my favorite shirt. Uh, anyways. Like, I just finished editing the video, and I heard, like, 20 million ums. Ugh. Now I know. Don't do that, Hazel. Don't do that. <laughs> Unfortunately, the video was longer than I thought it was going to be. I even said in the video, I better not make this video too long. But it's hard to edit. Like, I really try. I do. I'll get better at it. I will. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Yo, that's so ugly. Okay. Thank you for watching this video. Bye.